box. So the sad monkey. Now, what if the monkey is really, really big? Well, the first thing that we notice is how big this monkey is. So we put the adjective big first because it is the first thing we notice. This monkey is big. It is King Kong. We also notice that the monkey is sad. So it is the big sad monkey. Why do we not say sad big monkey, not last? Because we don't see that King Kong is sad. We see King Kong far away, and we see that King Kong is very big. Now, perhaps some people think that King Kong is ugly. Suppose that we see King Kong from far away. Okay, he's big. We know he's big. Now, as we get closer to King Kong, we see that he is ugly. And after we see that he is ugly, we get even closer to King Kong, and we notice that he is sad. So, first, we see he's big. Second, we see he's ugly. And third, we see that he is sad. So he is a big, ugly, sad monkey. A car. What is the first thing we notice about the car? That it is blue. We notice the color first. Blue car. We also notice that it is small. Blue small car. Um, now, this is okay, but it's more natural to put the size before the color. So we could say small blue car. Usually, physicality comes first in any adjective description. Um, now, what if the car was old? Well, then we could... Uh, maybe we notice that the car is old when we stand very close to the car. So, we would put the adjective old at the end. Small, blue, old car. Um, now, maybe we notice that the car is old from a distance because we see from far away that the car has some rust on it. So then we could say, small, old, blue car. So, okay, so we're driving and we see this car far away and we notice that it is small. First, we notice it is small. As we drive closer, we see that it is old. And then, last, we mention that it is blue. Now, suppose that we first notice that it's blue. Then we could use blue first. Blue, small, old car. It's what we want the person we're telling this to, the person we are saying this to, we want them to see the image. So, if we say blue first, that's the image we want to give first, that it is blue, and that it is small, and that it is old. Um, maybe it's broken. Blue, small, old, broken car. Or we could say small, old, broken, blue car. So whatever we think is the most important, if we're talking to our auto mechanic, we could tell the mechanic, I have a broken, small, old, blue car. Or I have a broken, because a mechanic wants to know if the car is old, I have a broken, old, small, blue car. The most important detail to the mechanic is that it's broken and that it's old, and that it's small, because a mechanic needs to know this information first. However, if we're talking to an artist, then we might want to say blue first, because artists like colors. So we can use the order of adjectives creatively.
to make a picture to the person we are talking to. Rules in English, like old yellow dress. They'll tell you this rule that you have to put the color before the noun and then the age before the color. Because it's very unnatural in English that you would ever see this, yellow old dress. Now the reason why it's unnatural in English to see this is because you would never notice a dress is yellow before noticing that it's old. You would first notice that the dress is old and then notice that it's yellow because old is the most important adjective. I hope you enjoyed this video and that it will help you to speak English better. Don't forget to subscribe.